how many four digit numbers which are divisible by six can be formed using the digits zero two three four six such that no digit is used in more than one and zero does not occur in the leftmost position we're looking at four digit numbers and so there are five digits here out of these five one should be left out should you have a multiple of six that means it should be a multiple of two and a multiple of three so it should be an even number that's also a multiple of three now two plus three plus four plus six plus zero if i added all the digits two plus three is five five plus four is nine nine plus six is fifteen this is fifteen this is a multiple of this is a multiple of three if you had all of this it will be a multiple of three so if we drop something then that should also be a multiple of three or if you drop the multiple of three that will work or we could have the digits as two four six zero two three four zero or two three four six two plus four plus six twelve that's a multiple of three two plus three plus four nine that's a multiple of three two plus three plus four plus six this is 15 that's a multiple of three and so the digits could be two four six and zero two three four and zero two three four six all of these are possible right now with these four digits we want to have the number of possible even numbers that are there two four six zero all four are even numbers and so we can say any four digit number formed with these that should work for the first digit there are three possibilities it cannot obviously be three that's ruled out uh, the first digit cannot be zero so that cannot be one of the possibilities so three possibilities second digit three possibilities third digit two possibilities and one possibility for the last digit three into three nine nine into two eighteen eighteen possible numbers with two three four zero find that we need to look at even numbers now there's a complication here we cannot just worry about the total number of numbers because the last digit cannot be odd and so since there's only one odd digit let's find out the total and then subtract the combination where there's a last digit right so total possibilities is the first digit cannot be zero so three options for this two three or four whatever this is that should not be in the second digit three two one so three and three two two into one 18 possibilities exist for this of this 18 there'll be some combination where the last digit is three and that means two four zero go here but zero cannot go into the first slot so two possibilities here two possibilities here one possibility here four such numbers are possible we're talking about two zero four three four zero two three two four zero three four two zero three subtract these four 14 numbers are possible and so 18 numbers with these digits 14 with these digits 2 3 4 6 now there's no zero constraint so totally there are 24 numbers possible rearranging this of these if we have to have the last digit as 3 2 4 6 get rearranged in three factorial ways out of the four factorial three factorial numbers three factorial different combinations will be odd numbers so four factorial minus three factorial 24 minus 6 18 numbers work satisfying both our condition that it should be an even number and should be a multiple of of three so 18 numbers with these digit combinations 18 plus 18 36 36 plus 14 50 50 numbers are possible all of which are four digit numbers that are divisible by three using the digit 0 2 3 4 6 such that no digit is used more than once or each digit appears exactly once whichever four digits are chosen so 50 numbers are possible totally brilliant 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 question first sketch isolate the digits that can be possible then count rigorously make sure we account for two conditions the last digit should be even first digit should not be zero